Okay guys, I'm going to dive right in here and show you the Groove Shark Follower Bot. Uh, what you're going to want to do here after you open the program is you'll see three modules. The Groove Shark Email, Groove Shark Pass, and the Proxy IP Port. Uh, what you're going to want to do is enter your Groove Shark Email first. And then your Groove Shark Password and then the proxy if you're using a proxy if not then you can just leave it blank and then you're going to click run I'll maximize it here so you guys can see what I'm doing okay and you also notice some random wait times here in the bot uh, those are to emulate the human interaction which is best for your accounts. It's going to enter the email and then enter the password. And then it's going to go ahead and click sign in for you. Okay. And then after it clicks sign in, you're going to notice it's going to say login done so you go ahead and click OK now click on the followers tab now the screen's cut off here but you can see that it has 5, 10, 25, 50, 100, 200, and 500 I'm going to pick 5 followers for this run I'm going to go ahead and click run and then I'm going to go ahead and let the bot do its thing now what, what you'll see is it'll enter, enter in a random username or e I'm sorry first name and it's generated out of a huge list of first names um, and if it doesn't find a first name or any song matches based on that name it will pick a random song so don't worry about that either you'll see that it, go, it clicked following followed now you see the prompt you are now following and you can see that's putting a new name and it's going to repeat the process five times now I'm going to go ahead and let it continue the process and I'm going to explain a little bit about the requirements um, basically all you need is medium to fast private proxies um, if you're going to be running this, um, just because the wait times, you want to make sure that you know the connection can be stable enough to handle the wait times, um, or a medium to fast internet connection if you're not using proxies. Um, processor, just a dual core is fine. 2.2 um, RAM, two gigabytes is fine. Space, under five megabytes, so it's very small. Um, you know, this is this bot is created with UBot Studio uh, developer, so y there is some issues with you know using a lot of resources. So I would limit uh, the amount of bots to three uh, if you're running it on a dual core, um, just to uh, decrease the amount of problems um, that the bo the bots will have. Um, so you can keep running for longer periods of time. So as you can see here, it's on the fourth process. It's going to add. It's going to keep following until it hits the end of the process loop, and then you'll see a followers completed alert message um, that will tell you that the bot's completed its loops. So I'll just give it one moment here. And also note that you can view the followers you added at the top module there where it says followers added. Um, that will show an increment number um, based on how many processes already gone through. Okay, so followers completed. So go ahead and click OK. And now it's done. And I'm going to show you here what it's doing. If you go to view profile, and go to following 
and click artist these are the artists that we just followed so throughout the mix there will be artists and, and, and people um, depending on you know the type of person that it finds um, and it's all based on random so you can just keep it going and going and going and going alright hope you enjoyed thank you